2K Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, proudly presents the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Tour Championship is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this final round action. I'm Luke Elvey, here alongside Rich Beam. And Rich, it's the final round in this one. What's our next player dealing with as they start their round? Should be a lot of nerves. They got the lead. They've been sleeping on it overnight. That is never an easy thing to do. Almost an uncomfortable situation at times, but they are playing well, so they have that confidence going into the final round. But this is going to be a tough afternoon ahead. Well, it's time for the preamble to be set aside. Let's get into the action. And let's see what he can do here today. Oh, that was pure. And Henny, what kind of a shot are they facing this time? They can't quite see the green here, Luke, because it's elevated, it's much higher. They're definitely going to have to club up. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. Yeah, that one's looking good. This player showing zero signs of any nerves as they play against their rival and playing partner, Tiger Woods. What a fantastic approach. Yeah, this is looking nice. They're nicely hauled. Can't birdie them all unless you birdie the first loop. Good start. Currently in first position. But this is quite an astonishing performance by our leader. Their advantage now out to double digits. I'm not sure if the chase back is good enough to catch them. Here we are at the second tee. Going with the six iron here. Well, good looking shot here. That's headed towards the green. Well, that'll be one of the shots of the day, that's for sure. Oh, that's a great shot. It sets up a wonderful birdie look here at the second. Luke, nothing gets past you. Yes, this kid is a stud. Oh, gee, that line was looking good, wasn't it? A par part of weights. Okay, let's head to the next. Let's take a look at the leaderboard now after that hole, and they're currently in first. Lydia Ko holds second. And now teeing off on this par four hole. It's like they got all of that one. That's on a good line. Luke, unfortunately, that got a horrible kick. Ended up in the rough. Yikes! Yeah, that's some golf, particularly from that terrain. Three feet to go here to the hole. Well, that'll play. And after that performance, they'll stay right where they are in the standings. We've arrived at a par four. This one looks to be headed towards the fairway. Time for the second shot here at the four.
chosen the pitching wedge here. Wow, what a shot. Already had a few birdies today. This for another. This putt is about 10 feet from the hole. This for a birdie birdie run. Looking better. The putt drops and that's back to back birdies. Two in a row there, Luke, getting their groove on. Our current leader now enjoying a nine stroke lead. Let's see what happens here at the fifth. Well, this should find the short grass. And Henny, what's he looking at here? Well, by my estimation, they're looking at 110 here. Well, this one's right at the pin. Oh, that's great. It just missed the hole. I've known some good iron players in my day, but you're right up there. Dare I say, Luke, this player has been in fuego with his approach shots. Another green in regulation. Well, what a start. This is impressive. Trying to make a statement early and often. This player must be in heaven. Their lead is now 11. The par five awaits here, but so does an opportunity. Take full advantage. You don't need to be long off the tee, Luke. It's only 525 yards, but the second shot plays straight back up the hill. So a little length helps. That one was fired out of a cannon. This shot from the first cut of rough. Opting for the hybrid, I think. Good shot there, Beamer. And he's down there. You got a read? He's staring down 23 feet here. That's frustrating. Good putters will make these right on five feet. This looks like it's got the speed and the line. Mark it down. That's birdie number five. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. A long bar for this hole. Yeah, give yourself a pat on the back. And playing this one from around 120 yards out. Opting for the 9-iron. Nine this one looks to be heading towards the green. Uh, this player's dialed in. What a shot. Yeah, nice looking shot there. Almost a gimme birdie there, Luke. Fantastic. 
Mark it down. That's six birdies today. Leading by a potentially insurmountable 11 strokes after that one. Not sure why I said potentially. We've reached the eighth hole. Wow, that was just striped. And Henny, what are you seeing down there? Yeah, he's looking at maybe a little over 130 to the pin. Looks to have opted for the eight iron. Look at the line on this one. Get in the hole. A great shot here at the eighth and a chance for birdie. 11 feet left to the hole. This is their look at birdie. Tracking. Oh, what a round this is. Seven birdies today. Still in the lead now after that hole. Teeing off here at the ninth hole. Going with the hybrid. Oh, this is on a fantastic line. Is it the right distance? A oh, lovely looking shot into birdie range here at the ninth. Always nice to hold those for a birdie. It's a lofty position this player has held all tournament, but what a buffer they've built with just nine to play. <laughs> so impressive all week long. I got to say this player is on top of the golfing world at the moment. Second shot here at the 10th. Going with the 9-iron, nine I think. Oh, I like that strike. This one's hitting well towards the green. How close was that to going in the hole? Great shot. A birdie putter waits. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. Looking to ride the momentum after coming off a birdie here with this shot. Opting for the six iron. That was a beauty right against the hole. Oh, stop it. What a shot. Putting for birdie here. He's making this look easy. Keeps surging ahead. And after that fine display, they are holding first spot on the leaderboard with Lydia Ko trailing in second place. Now on the tee after a birdie. Fired up and ready for more. That was wonderfully done. Second shot here on the 12th. Five feet coming up to the cup. Their short game today has been absolutely sublime fun to watch. Yeah, you like the look of that right off the blade. leading by a phenomenal 12 strokes after that one. The lead is getting bigger and bigger. It's time to take a look at this 13th hole. A 
that should finally cut stuff. Henny, what's the player facing here? Yeah, fair amount of elevation here. They're going to have to be careful that they club up because you do not want to be short. This one is all over it. Oh, that's a great shot. And sets up a birdie look here at the 13th. Got to like their chances from there. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. And coming off the birdie, they'll be proud of themselves. A chance to keep it rolling. This looks to be a fairway seeker to me. Taking aim from about 180 yards here. Going with the seven. All right, he's going with a little extra club, gone against the caddy here. Let's see if it was the right shout. Well, take notes, folks. That's how you do it. Lining up the birdie putt here. That will drop, and it will extend the lead. Let's take a look at the leaderboard now after that hole, and they're currently in first. Lydia Ko holds second. Well, let's get amongst this 15th hole. to be going with the six iron. Yeah, good safe shot this one. That should find the surface. That's a great shot here at the 15th. It sets up a look for birdie. Six feet remaining to the cup. Little birdie look in here. I like the look of this. Yeah, it's a lovely putt to make for birdie. Take some pride in that one. Yeah, nice to have that cushion heading down the last few holes. And now that finds him in first place. Three holes remaining, Luke. This is getting awfully fun. Next up is this two-shot hole. This one looks to be heading for the sanctuary of the fairway. Lining up here after a bunch of birdies, Rich. Absolutely. It's been a good streak late in the round. This is looking pretty good in the air. Well, you can see why he's leading. That was a shot of high caliber. Well, the practice is paying off here, Luke. This player is relentless. That was a gallant attempt. Well, this would be a good one to make. It's for par. In the end, that will be a disappointing par after such a great approach shot. This player must be in heaven. Their lead is now 11. Two holes to go, Luke. Can they hang on? Let's find out. And what's in front of them there, Henny? And from about 105 yards. 
Going with the pitching wedge here. A wonderful shot and a chance for Booty here on the 17th. And they'll tap this in for Birdie. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Well, what a lovely position to be in. Holding the lead, playing the last. Good luck. That was fantastic. What a shot from the leader. Woo-wee. They show movies on flights shorter than that. Looks to be going with a hybrid here. Come on, look after us. Little bounce to the right here. Outstanding approach shot. This putt for him to win the event. by the hole hopefully they won't take that too badly there's another chance here to close out the victory well there you have it rich a season long worth of excellence celebrated with the fedex cup oh what a feeling it must be as well to just have all the hard work and everything that they've prepared for and done this year comes down to one tournament they get it done they win the fedex cup I mean, what a sense of relief on the player's face right there. And it just has to be an amazing feeling all around. Well, when it comes to performances that they'll remember, that certainly has to be one of them. What a brilliant play today. Luke, while they've been out on the golf course, I've been cooking. Here, smell this. We've got to eat up. It's some humble pie. We shouldn't ever have doubted them. There was some spectacular golf out there, and it was a pleasure to watch. Well, that just about concludes our coverage. I'm Luke Elvey, and on behalf of Rich Beam, plus all the hard-working folks at HB Studios, it's good night for now.